everyone welcome back or welcome to my channel if you're new so i was sat at home wondering what type of content to create for you guys for halloween this year i know a lot of you guys love my content when it comes to this side of the year and as 2020 is slowly leaving us we're getting towards the end of this horrendous weird year i just thought i'd switch up my content a little bit make it a bit more fun and finally do these videos that i never had time to do last year so that is the plan for the series this year so yeah i'm here to kickstart my Halloween series for 2020 by having my boyfriend recreate a Halloween makeup look. Now I've sent him a little challenge to find a look that he feels like he can recreate. He's made a little video so I insert that in here as well and he's basically not really a fan of this time of the year. It's cold, it's gloomy, it's dark. He doesn't really show much interest in Halloween and you know this, the kind of autumnal stage into winter basically. He's more of a summer person so I just thought what a great combination of getting the things I love with the things that he hates and just combining them together. So I'm really excited to see how this video turns out. I've not seen anything like this on YouTube before, but then again, I haven't really looked into it. So hopefully this video is going to be really cool. I hope you guys do enjoy. If you do, please make sure you smash this video a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel if you want to see more of my Halloween series over the next couple of weeks. And without further ado, let's get Josh and start off this makeup look because I'm really excited to see how this whole thing turns out. It's going to be really weird and really fun. So yeah, let's go. Hello, so this is Josh and Cora's gave me the task of basically searching up some ideas for a makeup thing for Halloween. Uh, I'm not very good at doing stuff like this, but I'm gonna try it anyway. All right, let's have a look then. Uh, most of them at the moment are all just basically clowns by the looks of it. So, as you can see here, most of them are obviously gonna be women. Uh, a lot of uh, clown ones by the looks of it. Half pumpkin face. All these are very, very well detailed. I might have to dumb down a little bit here. So like I said, look at that one there. I mean, like, it's just just so much detail into that. Right. Let's just go to Halloween face makeup. Plain. <laughs> Even plain ideas are still coming up with this. Pirate. Could do a pirate. Um, this is a lot harder than what it looks. I don't know what I'm going to do for her. A vampire would be easy, I think. I think a vampire would be a little bit easy. I might just search up Halloween. Uh monsters and see what that comes up as a curse it ain't gonna come up with anything easy is it i might just go for a pumpkin face paint and see how that goes uh i think that'd be the easiest one to be honest with you so let's try and do it then hello i am here i've gone by a couple pictures online as you've seen before uh i think i've picked out a couple of them on which i'm trying to do um yeah so hopefully we'll uh get some egg dabbing going and uh, see how far we get. Yeah, because we did the um, boyfriend does my voiceover a couple of years ago, and um, it's really weird to see like Josh commentating that, like looking back on it now. Um, so yeah, to see Josh doing makeup is a very first for him. He's never done my makeup. He's got no interest in it whatsoever. So it's taken so long to get him sitting down here to do this. So we're gonna see yeah, how it so turns out. <laughs> let's talk him more paint. And come on. I have actually primed my face. For this video because I don't know how this is gonna turn out. Should I close my eyes yet or no? Not yet. Oh no, I need to do nose black. Yeah, but you can go over that, oh, can you? Oh no. So um what's your favourite Halloween film then? I don't have one. You don't have one? No. You've never even watched Drop Dead Fed, have you? I don't want to. You've not watched Beetlejuice? No. You literally have no interest in Halloween. I do? Stay still then. Stop distracting yourself. I'm trying to get some questions, make this video a bit fun. No, it ain't. It is. Look at that. Don't you think you should use a bigger brush first, but. No. Okay. Look, look how nice it's coming on, look. <laughs> I have to get up and I. You're gonna have to move a bit. You've got a twirly chair there. Yeah, but your face ain't twirly. <laughs> My neck kind of goes, but it's like 180. Shh, 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 shh. Look at that. What's his name? Vincent Van Gogh. Do you believe in multi-dimensional worlds? You know, they've got the new um, Spider-Man coming out when they're doing There's that. It's a multi-universe thing. Multi-universe, yeah. yeah. You believe in that, do you? No. Some people do, don't they? 
Nice. You think there's like oh, a I keep, complete... I keep doing it by accident. I keep putting places where I need to put black. Yeah, but it's alright. Right, before I do that, I'm going to do a black. I look like Spider-Man at the moment, actually, saying that. But where's black? Is this black? Right, I need to do a... I'm going to do a thinner brush for this this time. Do a thinner um, brush. Have you ever been or have you ever considered going to a graveyard at night? Did you ever do it when you were younger? Um, no. I'm being funny, the last thing I want to see... I, I don't know, I, it, it feels I've weird, always wanted it? to go camping there, but knowing our luck... In a graveyard? Yeah. Just to see if it's true, if stuff does come up. Mm. But knowing our luck, something would come up, and uh, it would probably be your mum. Next like step. That. What are we doing? Yeah, so we do what are we doing? Doing this nose now. Oh, that's brave. That's it. Get some lines going. That's it. Look at that. The detail on that. Look at that. I don't know if I should be scared of the way I look, look or the way that. this is going. <laughs> oh my god. At least when you do this, there's no pressure to actually make the makeup look good. Do you know what I mean? This is supposed to be scary, so. There we are. Some nose. That's the nose done. Cute as a button. You're uh, home alone, but you hear footsteps in your house. What do you do? Run. <laughs> Run where? Run. In your house? <laughs> well, no, I've, I hear footsteps in my own home. I'm, I'm grabbing that baseball bat. So, from what I can tell, I've got to turn to your eyelids now. Okay, do you want me to close my eyes? Yes. Alright, I'm going to do this. Stay still. I'm trying. I like how delicate you're doing this. This is terrible. It's meant to be a straight line. <laughs> right, open them up. Ta-da! I don't want to go too close to your eyes. Do you find it helpful standing up doing this, do you? Mm-hmm. Well, does a barber sit down when he does your hair? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> no. Exactly. So, yeah. So ask some dumb questions, love. That's it. Is that both eyes done, is it? Yeah, it's both eyes done. Oh. Right, now I've got to do the mouth. Just I love how you're scared to go right. with the It's the mouth now. Uh, right. I think you should have a nice long mouth. Uh, that's it. Yeah. Is that it? Yeah. Shall we put the lip back? Put the lip back. Alright. Stop moving the lip. That's it. Look how black that looks. Alright, alright. <laughs> I like this. I look like I've been in the rain already. It's coming together well. I'm trying to get another question. Face ID doesn't recognise me, so that's good. What's the creepiest thing that's ever happened to you when you're at home alone, or just when you're alone? I don't know. Um, I can't. Funny. I can't. I can't multitask. You know, don't you? I okay. can't. I can't do this. And <laughs> Sorry, too much pressure is there. Okay. Um, okay. I don't know. I, what was the creepiest thing that's happened to me? Um, like when you're on your own, like, oh my god. When I was, when I was on holiday at a caravan, I thought the caravan was haunted because <laughs> I went went to go to the toilet in the middle of the night and the lights turned on in the, in the caravan at the front. Right. I was like, hello. <laughs> no one was there. Right. And, uh, yeah, it just scared me up because I was a bit, like, scared because I was like, who's done that? <laughs> in your haunted caravan. No, no, seriously. And then next thing, because we thought it was a pot of ice in there. Oh, <laughs> a, a pot, pot of ice? Or, no, uh... <laughs> A, uh, a poltergeist. What's that? It's like one of those demons that come alive. <laughs> like they're, they're ghosts. How old were you? Like, about like 14. <laughs> poltergeist? Yeah, do you know what If I find is? it, I'll put a picture up. It's a ghost that's that can move objects and stuff. <laughs> like turn a light on outside the caravan. No, seriously, it was in the caravan. In the caravan? Yeah, so oh I went to the toilet in the caravan. Well, I didn't go to the toilet outside the caravan. It was a static. <laughs> so I'm there going to wee. Next to near, And the light come on and off. I was like, hello? I don't know to this day. Come on, sort it. I don't know to this day if someone was taking a piss or what. But it scared me. Come on. This is really good. I did a mistake in putting black lines down already before I put finished the orange. Oh, this is quite a good one. What? You thought about this quite a lot, haven't you? In a zombie apocalypse, what is your weapon of choice? Um, it'll have to be either a crowbar or... So you have thought about this. It'd be a big uh, adjustable spanner, because you can use them for multiple things. Because mm. it ain't just for killing. <laughs> killing zombies. No, you can actually do stuff with it as well. Mm. Do you know what's also good? What? 
his face. His face is looking fine. You're cutting in some lines there, aren't you? Yeah, look, look, look at that then. Yeah, look. I feel like I'm ready to party after this. Would you rather go to a Halloween party or trick or treating? I've been to a Halloween party. I've been to a couple of them. I was never a big fan of trick or treating because my mum and dad used to put me in the most stupidest costumes. <laughs> like what? What's the worst one? Pumpkin. Okay, so you're doing me as your worst. Well, no, it's a fact. I went as a massive pumpkin. <laughs> Like five, was this like, in your fat stage, was it? This when Toby Josh was a thing. So they put you in a pumpkin costume? Yes. That's to make you feel like you fit in with all the other kids. Makes me fit in, alright. I fitted into that costume. That's all I fitted into. What other costumes have you been in? <laughs> you, you forced me into a werewolf costume. Yeah. I didn't, didn't, and me got embarrassed because no one else dressed up. Yeah, that's when we went to um, Avon Fair Valley, wasn't it? Yes. We were the only people who dressed up. Yeah. Uh, I dressed up as a Jamaican bobsleigh one year. Oh yeah. Yeah, for a Halloween party. That was fun. How'd that go? Yeah, it was good. That was one of the last Halloween parties I had. <laughs> That's looking better. You fix up all your little mishaps? Not quite. If you could only wear one Halloween costume for the rest of your life, what would it be? Uh, I'd have to be a pirate because I would actually fit in well when I'm Bristol wearing yeah, that. I was thinking it would definitely yeah. be a pumpkin after that. Story. Right, hold on. Close, close your eyes again. Alright, let's go to the other side now. Close your eyes and you will see. Oh, what are you doing? You're scaring me. Mm. How is it compared to your uh, picture inspiration? I don't know. Let's have a look. Catch up. Right, okay, I think I know what I've got to do next. Mm. This is going to be a bit difficult. Let's try it then. So, let's get a black line going across your forehead. So, where's your wrinkles to? Well, it looks like it's got, it's got, it's a bit more water. It has got a line, it's got your cheekbones oh, are see, def yeah. defined. Okay. So your cheekbones like that, and then also you've got a thin line going down like that, a thin line going down like that, and you've got a couple going down like that. Nice. So now on your cheekbone again, like that, a bit more on there. <laughs> there. That's looking good. Have I got very defined cheekbones now? I think the problem's going to be is these eyebrows. Why? Because I don't know how I'm going to get them black. Paint them. If it wasn't for like restrictions this year, if you was to go to a Halloween party, what would you go as this year? Uh, if you actually had a choice in it this year, because obviously Queen. Queen. What? Freddie Mercury. Freddie Mercury. What about Brian May? Which one's Brian May? The drummer. Like the big curly hair. Oh, that'd be sick, wouldn't it? Imagine that with that hair. Mm. Look at the size of those brows. So you've just gone straight with the brows then? Yeah. Yeah. Well, I couldn't find nothing else to do it with. Come on, let's sort this out. Oh shit. <laughs> what is this brow going so wrong? There you go. Is that it, is it? Yeah. Complete. In less than 20 minutes, what can we say? Well, look, you still look good. So this is my um, Halloween pumpkin get up. Yeah. How, how would you rate it? To be fair, I've, I've seen worse. You've seen worse? Yeah. To be fair, I think I've done a good job. Has she defined the cheekbones? Yeah. The cheekbones, what the nose, the yeah. eyes. Yeah. So you could literally create this look using which products, Josh? Just, just two. So we've got the orange face paint and black to create this look. So yeah, are you impressed with your first uh, Halloween look? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, ain't too bad. Like I said, I ain't done too bad actually, because that that pass in a Halloween costume because you know, stick on a. What we've got to do is, or... you have to sort out that nose though, and uh, well, those eyes. Because also I haven't gone too... I You've can't... left my nostrils Yeah, out. I can. I can. I don't want to do too much. But I don't know, I don't want to get stuff in your eyes or your nose. Why? Because it's just weird, isn't it? What would it do? I don't know, what would it do? I don't know, but you put it all over my lip. No, but you don't want to get it in your eyes. Why, what would That's when I want to get paint in your eyes. Oh, so you're, that's caring, isn't it? Yeah, so I'm happy about that. Got Mrs. Pumpkin here. I'm happy, I've got my smile drew on. Now we're gonna scare some little kids down at the park. Come on, it's gonna scare them. Yeah, let's go. No, anyway, um, so yeah, this has been Josh doing my Halloween makeup this year. I hope you guys have enjoyed watching. Um, what do you guys think of the overall look and in comparison to the uh, inspiration picture? How are you feeling about it? Let me know in the comment section down below. And yeah, this has been my first video for Halloween this year. I hope you guys have enjoyed and I'll see you all in my next one. Bye. Bye-bye.